The planet J1407b is located 400 light years away from Earth and boasts planetary rings that are 200 times bigger than the rings of Saturn. Scientists don't completely understand how this strange planet managed to acquire rings of such an enormous size. The rings of J1407b are so large that if Saturn's rings were as large, they would dominate the Earth's sky and appear much larger than a full moon. Inside the Crux constellation, approximately 300 light years from the Earth, lies the loneliest planet in the known universe. Cataloged as HD 1069.06b, this planet is 11 times bigger than Jupiter. Astronomers have dubbed this planet as a Super Jupiter. HD 1069.06 orbits its parent star at a distance 20 times greater than the space between the Sun and Neptune, which is about 60 billion miles. Its extremely unusual distance from its star makes it one of the loneliest and isolated planets in existence. Over 750 light years away from our solar system lies a planet known as Trace 2b. This planet is remarkable because it is the darkest planet known to exist. This dimly lit and menacing planet reflects less than 1% of the light that hits its atmosphere. This is so little light that the atmosphere of Trace 2b reflects less light than coal and black acrylic paint does. The tiny fraction of light that isn't reflected by the planet's thick and suffocating atmosphere is faintly red, causing the planet to dimly glow in an evil red color. The planet 55 Cancri E is a girl's best friend, because 55 Cancri E is actually just a massive diamond out in space orbiting a distant star. When 55 Cancri E was formed, it was comprised mostly of carbon, and thanks to the intense pressure and heat from its parent star, 55 Cancri E compressed into a massive, unpolished diamond. This diamond planet is so huge that it has been valued at an incomprehensible $26.9 nonillion, which is only about 384 quintillion times the Earth's GDP. But before you set out for this diamond planet with a drill, 55 Cancri E is located over 40 light years away from Earth. And if you were still somehow able to bring the diamonds back with you, the sheer amount of diamonds you would collect from the planet would crash Earth's diamond market instantly, making your diamonds completely worthless. Gliese 436 is a recently discovered ice planet that is about the size of Neptune. While that alone may not be very surprising, what is surprising about Gliese 436b's is that it's so close to its parent star that its icy surface is constantly on fire all year round. So you may be wondering, how could this happen? How could ice of all things burn constantly? Well, astronomers have determined that the reason why the icy surface of Gliese 436 never melts, despite the hellish inferno on its surface, is because of gravity. The gravitational force of Gliese 436b is so strong the ice covering its surface is physically prevented from evaporating, leaving the planet perpetually enveloped in icy flames. WASP-12b is a planet that orbits dangerously close to its parent star. WASP-12b orbits so close that it is slowly being eaten alive. Every orbit drags more of the planet's mass into its hungry star, and because of the immensely strong shearing gravitational force originating from its star, WASP-12b has even been distorted into an unnatural egg shape. Gliese 581c is a planet that scientists have concluded could possibly support life. But Gliese 581c is no ordinary planet, and even though it could theoretically support life, it does not at all look like Earth. Gliese 581c orbits a tiny red dwarf star, and because it is tidally locked, one side of the planet is constantly subjected to harsh sunlight, while the other half remains forever shrouded in darkness. The only place where you or anything else could survive on Gliese 581c is in the narrow strip of twilight between the two sides, where the temperature can support life. The skies of Gliese 581c are a deep crimson, and every plant on the surface would have to use infrared light for photosynthesis, giving them a deep black color instead of green. Because of this planet's amazing potential for life, in 2008 a message was broadcasted directly at Gliese 581c in hopes of making contact with life there. The message should reach Gliese 581c in 2029. 
nicknamed Waterworld, a planet cataloged as GJ1214b, has been identified as an ocean planet that has absolutely no land. Not unlike the water planet seen in the movie Interstellar. And anyone on the surface of GJ1214b would only see ocean in all directions. The global oceans on GJ1214b are also miles deep, stretching all the way down into the planet's core making GJ-1214b a unique water planet. WASP-17b is very unusual because it is the largest planet ever discovered. Coming at over 1.9 times the size of Jupiter, WASP-17b's size and low density has confounded astronomers. In fact, it is so large that WASP-17b's existence violates our current understanding of how planets form. Perhaps even more oddly, WASP-17b has a retrograde orbit, meaning this planet orbits in the opposite direction of its parent star. Most planets do not orbit this way, making WASP-17b a rare stellar mystery. Known as HD 188753, this planet is located in probably the most bizarre solar system in the known universe. Located 151 light years away, this planet's solar system has three stars. That means anyone standing on HD 188753 would have triple shadows, witness almost daily solar eclipses, and see a sunset no matter which direction they faced on the planet. If you want to travel the universe with us to all these magnificent planets, be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And if you want to hear my voice some more, come check out my channel in the description. Or if you didn't like the video, I'm sorry Dave, I can't let you leave a dislike. That's what he says in the movie, right?